just wanna play it. Hey guys, what's up to them? Well, so I have to make the crazy AI effect in Premiere Pro. So without wasting any time, let's jump into it. Yo guys, we're back in Premiere Pro. Now I'm gonna show how to add the crazy AI effect in here. So I already have my clip. This is for Nil Take Out of Love Music video. Then I'm gonna go few frame forward, almost like here. And I'm gonna cut the clip right here and hit the export frame button. If you don't see that, hit the plus icon and drag the export frame and drop it right there then just hit the export frame it will just what it will do is just take a screenshot of your of that frame so i'm gonna call it one and i'm gonna set the format to jpeg and then i recommend creating a new folder called ai and select that folder name it one and just hit ok and then hit arrow key on your keyboard go one frame forward take screenshot of that call it two and hit ok do that to almost like 15 frame you should at least have 15 Fame. so i'm gonna do that and see you guys browse through your folder and you will have uh, 10 15 screenshots like this then open up your browser and search tenzo m ai image to image link will be in the description if you want to check it out then what you want to do is go to the folder and drag the first image drag and drop it on here so it is a drag right here and you can choose some style in here like they have anyway stable diffusion kind of stuff and i'm gonna lower down the strength to like and i'm gonna add some prompt you can add whatever you like and i'm gonna write that you can also go to the more options and you have some settings right here too you can add some negative prompts they are also built in here and just hit run it would take some time so take your time and be patient your another image lower down the strength so do that to every single clip and i'll see you later i actually exported uh, 15 frames but i was uh, lazy to convert all of those i did 10 of those now I'm gonna drag and drop all of these into it because it is 10 frame i'm gonna go 10 frame forward and you can extend this then start by dragging your fast footage it is really small so i'm gonna scale it up then make it three frame long so i'm gonna go three frame forward and cut the layer and do that to every single one then I can just select this clip and right click and just hit the nest. And we already have this crazy AI effect. It is a bit slow, so I'm gonna speed it up. And I can even add some effect in here, like like I can add a sick, I can drag a S sick. You see, we get the crazy sick, and we can add some brightness and contrast in here and our lumetri color. And we don't really need brightness and contrast because we added lumetri color. So I'm gonna go to here. I can up the contrast a bit. Play with the highlights. I can even speed it up a bit. I just speed it up a bit and it looks like that. And I'll also add a quick little flash. To source it, it even more, I added this paper crumble sound effect. And you can see the final effect. Hey, really, 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 I just wanna play it. So that's it for today's video, guys. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more videos like this. See ya later. Bye.